Hi everyone. Yeah, today I am showing some tips of cable tray making. So, uh, who guys are working in electrical field? So here I I prepared some uh, dynamic block for uh, cable tray fittings. These are the cable tray fittings. These are some cable trays with dimensions. So this dimension is around uh, 150. So like that uh, we created some more uh, cable trays and fittings everything. So how it, how it's work just I will reduce like like this reducer. How it's work I will just show you. So here is one electrical room I have one plan. So this is the one electrical room and uh, another another one electrical cabinets over here. So I mean I will I will show you how it's work so just I will took one example one cable tray 600 mm cable tray so I use this one okay we'll move it here if you need this one uh, this dynamic blocks so please comment on my video so I will share with you this uh, dynamics block so uh, i will make one separate video for how to do how to make these dynamics blocks so first of all we will check the this one is working or not so uh, i have uh, some dbs over here uh, some dbs so i'll just copy some uh, dbs so i took one uh, db over here okay start to start from this one I have some blocks for uh, DB also so I'll copy from here and uh, for just to uh, the information so how to do this uh, 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 this dynamic box for the cable trace so guys uh, first of all I will just I have I prepared one uh, dynamic block of uh, six 600 so I will just use this one I will copy this too. Okay. Yeah, how it's work? We'll just uh, see. So my routing it's from here, from starting from this panel. So I just I will stretch up to here. So it's coming like this. So next is I I use this part, and one another I will place here and uh, one part i will place over here and one i will place yeah place it here okay so i will show you how it's work so i will connect with this one okay so I will just uh, stretch up to up to here and I will stretch up to here this is the easy way so if you prepare dynamic blocks is easy way so I am looking for the 600 fittings uh, 90 degree fittings this one I am using for this uh, here I will just uh, uh, will just mirror it this one okay rotate so i'll just place it uh, here and align with uh, this one so so it's work so i just stretch up to here the cable tray and i will stretch up to here just will make like this same thing so this is very easy in AutoCAD this is very easy procedure you can align with this one and stretch up to here yeah so you need here just mirror with this one okay and place uh, this one with the this edge and pick this one and stretch up to here this one I'll stretch up to here 
yes you understood right so i will i will just uh, mirror this one up to here so who guys are working in electrical drawings it is easy for uh, draw cable trace and you can change the layers and everything uh, like this see it's it's a very nice uh, nice part right yeah so another another thing so uh, you need to take some branches of this one so we'll just take this one and place it here i need one branch t junction i place i have already made this one so just you need to make one branch over here so we'll we'll stretch this one up to here okay and place one another here same thing and stretch up to here up to here so here see this it's work like uh, like uh, like this one also we have uh, we can we can draw the cable trace simply like this can delete it and you can uh, from the fitting also you you can extend this one then that is the one one thing see 600 you can uh, like this so no need to copy and paste it and you can draw like this so here also in from the fittings also you can stretch the cable tray up to here so next um, that is that, that is the one thing so if the different angles are here available different angles and uh, yeah different fittings are available here so next uh, next one is you have some reducer you need to some reduce the cable tray so up to here it's a uh, it's uh, 600 up to here so you need uh, from from here this one you need up to 400 cable tray so just uh, we'll do one thing rotate this one okay we pick one center point and place it here so this fittings is the reducer the here it is 600 to 400 the 600 to 400 we are reducing okay so just click here and uh, stretch up to wherever you want it's, it's going like this Uh, like that lot of uh, cable trays are here so we can make easily this one so another uh, this is a type of another cable tray or trunking you can use it so uh, so I will I will took one another one thing like a cable tray cable tray fittings I place here and I will rotate this one like this so we'll we'll try how it's work. So this one I can stretch up to here. From the fitting you can make it like. Uh, so then the next fit fittings we are required there. So we'll, we'll take another uh, fittings and place it here and mirror at this one. Rotate it door. Oh yeah, Rot mirror, mirror, just mirror at this one. Yeah, and uh, pick one point here, and we will connect like this. So like that, uh, we can we can uh, we can give some other uh, up and uh, we the cable trays are going up from here. We can we can do that one also here. So if you guys enjoy if you guys enjoy this video please subscribe and I will I will show you in the next video uh, for how to uh, how to set up the uh, dynamic blocks okay so please subscribe if you like the video so I will upload more more videos on on this uh, channel these are the dynamics blocks so, so we can adjust this one a stretch and up, up to here we can stretch it stretch it different angles we can make it 
so then the four point we can make the, this is the type of trunking so if you rotate like this align align with the, this this one okay if you are stretched like this it it was works see very nice it's very nice and uh, very uh, we can you can consume your time easily for making a f this type of parametric blocks so thanks for watching if you have any questions and comments just uh, drop a comments on this video thanks for watching and i will share you once you need uh, this uh, dynamic blocks and uh, I will s I will do one separate video for the uh, creating dynamic blocks. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching.